Hi, we're Julie and Ali, and together we are people behind Cottage Arts. Um, we just set up our stall for you today, part of the Folksy Market, um, and we're just going to talk you through a few of our Christmas designs for this year. The Pony Bear, it takes a lot of thought and design. I have to basically decide on what subject I'm going to do, how I'm going to produce it um, and it takes a few sketches and then colours I try and sort of see what colours go as it happened I changed that from from purple to blue and it matches our cyanotype, cyanotype collection which basically is done on white sensitive paper we've got some painted with light sensitive chemicals and you expose it to sunlight, sunlight. with the plants on we like doing it with plants and um, um, stones, we've done shells, yeah. seaweed, we've got, where, where, wherever we travel at the moment we've started collecting items and putting them on the light sensitive paper yeah. and exposing them. There's some videos of that on our social media from over the summer because we did quite a lot um, throughout the summer months when the sun was stronger and brighter. This time of year it's a bit more difficult but these are the three um, prints that ended up creating the three cyanotype Christmas cards that you can see. Well, you might not be able to see that one, but you can see these two on the table. And the glitter on the cards obviously give you that winter feel for frost. Um, Eco-friendly glitter. Yeah, the biodegradable glitter um, we use, and if we can't get hold of it, because it, it has been difficult of late, we mix it with the normal glitter. So you've always got a uh, mix, so it's never fully um, standard glitter. We also use biodegradable. Um, plastic wraps, which are, I think this is made by food, isn't it? It's starch, I think, right, mainly most of them. Um, Christmas designs for this year for um, writing paper. Um, so it goes down the border around um, like using our prints and our drawings, um, just to create a little pattern, basically. And for those of you who don't know about us, we, we do like to do most things in nature and we print with, with actual plants or we paint them. Um, it's like something like this, I would sit down and, and uh, maybe sketch them and draw them. I might not effectively use them to begin with, but we will use them eventually. Um, it might be a few years, it's like the polar bear, it was a couple of years in the making that I started that a couple of years ago and I did various sketches and I thought I thought I'd better put one of the old sketches in this sketchbook, I am absolutely atrocious at keeping all, all my stuff together as you can know. see <laughs> um, and that sketch there was one of the original ones that I took a couple of years ago I think it was and then the whim took me and I, I, for some unknown reasons, switched to foxes and did quite a lot of sketching on, on foxes and that's how the fox was born last year and there's, there's one of the sketches there that I was just doing to put the placement in. As you can see we're starting to do the prints now of some of our little drawings that we do. We're also doing notebooks and notepads. We've got note cards here as well, various different note cards, some little forget-me-not cards which you'll see on the website. As, uh, I know some of you sit there and, and ask us to, to let you see our new designs. Well we put them up on Instagram and Facebook as we're doing them and some like, like, a bit like you were saying before sometimes we put them up and then it's not until a few months later that we actually come up with the, <laughs> the final design or the final product but um, you can follow everything that we do on there. Oh no, you, you'll see a sketch on there of a baboon and it won't come up for another two years on these. <laughs> That's just figure of speech but basically yeah it, not everything will come out as soon as we've actually put it up on Instagram but we will put them up eventually it's just it's quite a long process it's to be honest. part of being a um, small business isn't it because you have to do everything in the all the different jobs so it just takes time to yeah. get, get everything it online. It takes time like, to collect yeah. stuff as well I mean we can intersperse a few little um, videos in this of, of where we've been and where we collect items usually on holiday or breaks or weekends out we're still working, we'll go along and we'll, we'll sketch something or or we'll pick something up off the ground and, and do various little designs and sketches. I've got a 
a few from when we've been on holiday before um, in the sketchbook here somewhere, if I can find them anyway. There's a few little sketches that, that have been done whilst out and about. I have another sketchbook now. I'm absolutely chaotic with sketches. I've got bits of paper here and sketchbooks there and I'll take one one week and take another the next. We'd like to thank you for if you've stayed with us this far and watched the video and also if you've made any purchases today we really appreciate them they help us to keep building on all the products that we offer and you got anything else to say? Well, basically with this being our Christmas little Christmas uh, show we'd like to say all have a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year and let's hope next year is good for everybody.